Hello everyone. Welcome to Digital Skilling course. In this video, we will see how to send Google Calendar invites. Open your web browser and navigate to calendar.google.com and log in with your email ID. As you see, this is your Google Calendar. To add an event in your calendar, click on the day when the event will take place or you can click on the create option which is available on the top left hand side of the screen while clicking on the create option a window will appear here we have to click on the more option near to the save tab first provide the event a title this title will be displayed in your calendar underneath the heading confirm the date and time of the event If an event is taking place all day, you can click the all day option here. If you don't want to repeat this, you can choose the option does not repeat so that it takes place once at a specific date and time. Click on the drop down and select the appropriate session. We can choose another option by selecting the option custom. For example, If you want to do some training from only Monday to Thursday then we can deselect Friday. After selecting this session you can add people to whom you need to send the invites. Now you can provide the email IDs of the people you need to invite to the meeting. If needed you can add the location thus Your guest can easily identify the location. Now, we can set the reminder for the meeting. For that, you can select the option tab just below the add location option. There will be two options for the reminder. You can select either email or notification. If you select email and set the time, then you will get notified through mail. If you select the notification option and set the time you will get the reminder as a notification Here you can choose busy or free when you add an event to calendar or when you accept a meeting that is added to your google calendar you are shown as busy for the event duration it means that if your calendar is shared with others Google will show you as busy for the related periods of times. For this exercise, I am changing the option to free. You can also decide on visibility and opt it as public or private. This event follows the sharing settings of this calendar. So, anyone who can see details of other events can also see this event details. including the description and names of attachments so here i am changing it to private so that only the people with whom i have shared can see the details of this event by clicking on add description or attachment option you can add more details about your event you can even attach a file by clicking on the paper clip icon Now we have added all the details for the meeting so that we can click on the save option. While clicking on the save option a pop up will appear where we can select if we want to send the invitation through emails to Google Calendar guests. If we are choosing the option send then the guest will receive the meeting invitation through mail and if we are selecting the option don't send The guests will not receive the invitation through the mail. Instead, they have to check their calendar manually. Here, I am choosing the option send. Here, you can see that the event is successfully added to my calendar and the person whose email IDs we have added as guests must have received the notification through mail. As you can see here, the person has received the mail where a Gmail link has also been generated. so that the guest can join the meeting through this link this is how we can send google calendar invite please try this out for your next event 
थैंक यू